more lies! No! Lies! She lies a lot. Well, she's a woman. Oh, fuck off! That's a low blow. <laughs> They're all low blow. <laughs> oh, fuck. Remember when Jen promised last year? You probably don't, but I'm gonna tell you. Once upon a time, Jen, a young naive girl, young naive girl, an old lady <laughs> decided she would beat some of the best games ever made. And I did. Some of she them. She said she set herself a goal last year. Yeah. She's gonna play more retro. I saw like we went around the game room, picked out. 10 really good retro games, like people are always talking about these, and you're like, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna beat them all. I'm like, oh, okay. Get to the point here, why Why didn't you actually play the games you said you were gonna Teddy, play? Teddy, it was Teddy's fault. Don't blame the yes! poor dog, that poor baby dog there, he's so sweet. He, he is What's so up with your bullshit? He, what? <laughs> I, we got, I got Teddy for Scott and Alex, I love him more. And stole him. And stole him, but, it made it hard to play games in the basement because he was little, he couldn't get down the stairs, he was shitting and pissing everywhere. He needed to be monitored 24 seven and if he wasn't, he was biting your feet. So it was really hard to play games. I did start out and play Final Fantasy VII right off the bat in mm -hmm. January. And then I played the remake right afterwards and that was a hard task because we had Teddy at that point. So he did get older and better and now he can be in the game room, but I lost focus. So, okay, let's do the ones the ones that you beat. Okay. So, out of the 10, you did... Four. So, Final Fantasy VII. Half-Life 2. Half-Life 2 in the Xbox. Shadow of the Blah Blossus. And Zelda. Legend of Zelda. So, out of that, out of those four, which one do you enjoy the most? Ooh. Didn't know I was going to ask you that. I know, you dickhead. I have... I think I have to lean this way. Yes. I caught a little bit of flack that that wasn't in my top three. So, and you should have. But this would probably be four and five out of the games I played last year. Maybe. I don't know. I don't want to look at the fucking list and I don't want to talk about it anymore. Um, okay. Other than the four games you did beat, what were the games that you tried and gave up on? I tried and gave up on some and I tried and I have a plan. They're bookmarked to go back. For starters, shut up. Say Scott that. did beat Chrono Trigger last year, and I started it on the DS. Freaking but awesome game. I started, it's so awesome. I know. You need to play it. It's I awesome. know. <laughs> but I started playing it on the DS, and that was right before I started working my two jobs. Here we go. In November. Another modern gamer listening up. All the reasons why she doesn't play retro games. Fucking bullshit. This one says she has, doesn't have enough time. But she failed to mention all the PS4 games she played. I believe it was over 40. But I can't say that. Or I'll be sleeping on the couch. So I'll just sit here with a stupid look on my face and pretend to agree. Um, Cocker's Bad Fur Day, I didn't even get around to putting in the machine. No, I'll just stick to the ones you tried and failed. Oh, okay. My well, face is punch out. It's going to cost too much to get a divorce if I continue to play that game. How do we divide this shit? Why is it my fault that you can't beat my like, Tyson Punch Out? If you live in the house or on the street, I'm gonna find you and I'm going to fucking bitch at you for no reason. I'm gonna be angry because that game makes me so fucking angry. I'm always angry. I didn't put that much time into it. Maybe a few days. You didn't make it the same, man. I think you got a soda pop. Yeah. Soda pop and yeah, I think so. he gave me a hard time. I think so whoever the fifth hard. last guy is, that's where I got. Worst thing you can think about it with the EverDrive, you have the ability to practice every fighter. <sighs> you can hit, you can beat, it'd be easier. It's way easier now. Not worth the jail time. He's a good dad. No patience. I can play Cuphead and that's fine. What? Psycho. <laughs> you know what it is? Because I know I don't have to do a complete run of it without dying. You know, I got the EverDrive. You can practice every fighter. Okay, I, don't I can beat the shit at everybody. Practice to play a game. I want to practice. fucking finish a game. I don't want to practice a game. Practice. No, I don't want to practice. practice. I don't want to do it. You know what? That'd be a hell of a feather in your cap. It's a good. I know, uh, but I don't know if I can. All right, Castlevania Bloodlines. I played that for about an hour. <laughs> I bit the controller. I didn't leave teeth marks. I didn't leave teeth marks. I was ready to fucking lose it. There was going to be bloodshed. 
from Bloodlines. <laughs> Do it, guys! I'm so fucking terrible! I'm not worthy! I'm not worthy! We're not worthy! We're not worthy! Your problem is you go into it thinking this is gonna be so hard. Oh, I go into every retro game yeah. with a rage. I beat Super Metroid this year. And? I fucking loved it. But he was fucking miserable for the first, what, two plays? You had to leave the I fucking walked into the game room because she's just raging over there. And I'm like, would you just go print off a map so you know where the hell you're going there? <laughs> Holy crud. And she did the same thing with Zelda. C-word. Clever. Cute. <laughs> I go into a retro game assuming it's going to be hard. So when I got to a point in Super Metroid, I thought I needed to be a ball and get to all the way up to fucking... Like tunnel. She's trying to drop, drop the bombs and bounce yeah. off. I'm, like, I'm looking at her. I'm like, I mean, there's a trick to that, but we said there was a weird trick to it. I assumed. Why well, is this after I, I watched you do it for like ten minutes? And I'm like, she must be following a a guide. There, somebody speed running. <laughs> <laughs> I was following no gun. Yeah, I just are. assumed because it was a retro game, it was gonna be hard. That's I had to do the hardest something. thing they can possibly do. Yeah. I, anyways, I did make it like halfway up it, but then I'd fall and, <laughs> and then I'd have an emotional fucking breakdown of not tears, rage. So, I don't think there were any other games that you tried. Right, you didn't try Final Fantasy 2 yet. No, and I intend on playing that Conquers, as well. Conquer's bad for it, you never touched. And I intend on playing that one as well. Metal Gear Solid, never touched it yet. No, haven't no. touched it yet. And I intend on playing that one as well. But fuck That's Mike it. Tyson's Punch-Out and Bloodlines. Like, fuck it all the way. Those okay. are classics. It's classically just not for me. I can't do it! But uh, the ones I did play, for the most part, I enjoyed instead of Shadow of the Blah Blosses, because it was <clears> blah. <throat> it was kind of blah. To me, I just, and you know what? From our video, people have come out of the woodworks and say, I'm just gonna be honest, I felt the same way. And I was like, thank you for validating my feelings. It was, a, it was feelings. beautiful for its time. Beautiful, but now it's beautiful, beautiful kind of... game, but it, there was just nothing to it except I go back, there'd yeah. be a cutscene, and then I go fight a Colossus. All and right, then I come stop, back. Let's stop bashing Colossus here. He's yes. a big guy there. He doesn't need your bullshit. He doesn't. So what are your plans? Are you are you revisiting any of these for 2023? Um, I, I don't want to make any promises. That's the thing. Well, don't. No. Say I you have some loose goals that you... I would like to. Loose goal? Honestly, I kind of want to run the gauntlet of all the God of War games. I'm talking about these games. You get off topic really Very easy there. Easy. Is it the coffee? Is it the blonde hair? Are any of these you were going to go back to? Are you going to... Yes. Besides Tyson and I really, I really think... I, I think I'll probably end up playing this. Conquer's Bad Fur Day. I know it's my humor. But I may not play it on the N64. I may end up playing it. The Xbox? On the Xbox. Just because it's a controller I'm more familiar with. Although I haven't played an N64 game all the way through, so... Maybe I should play it on the N64. I just can't see me growing up Open. enough to have patience to play these two. I would love to play Final Fantasy 2. So. See, <laughs> you just don't, you don't lean into RPGs. It's not really, you've played I them. I love action RPGs. Any yeah. action RPG I well, play. Well, you just got I, done I playing Kadelka there and that's not, that's like a tactics turn-based, right? That's like, it's got elements of tactics to it, turn-based, but it's also in my genre of horror, horror. right? Mm. So I really liked it. I don't know what it is about not loving like a colorful, bright, happy storyline. I'm like, boring. Give me creepy and messed up and... It's like your soul. <laughs> my soul. So say you're sorry to all the retro lovers out there and then we'll end this video. I'm sorry, but I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. If you guys had to pick, don't pick Mike Tyson's punch out or blood in the lunch. comments. Yes. Leave a comment. Like, tell us, tell us. All right, if you were to go and play one of these ten, which which one would you play? And if you're a regular viewer, you know Jen's crazy taste there. <laughs> that, that was a knife, not a. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, if you if you know Jen's crazy taste, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I'll play comment. Witcher 3 if that's the case. Yeah, co comment uh, comment down below which one you think she'll have the best chance at playing all the way through. Yeah. But anyways, that's my video. And um, until next time, game on. Or give up like Jen does. Or give up. But seriously, guys, from the bottom of my heart, 
I am so not fucking sorry. I didn't play those games. I'm not sorry. I had so much fun this year. So much.